13th time this season that Golden State has scored 70 and a half. <laughs> and uh, they lead the Clippers 70 to 58. Steph Curry 15 in the first half. Klay Thompson 17. Kevin Durant's got a dozen. And the lead is a dozen as we welcome you to the American Express halftime report. Ernie Johnson, Charles Barkley, Kenny Smith, and Shaquille O'Neal. American Express teammates. Uh, nobody individually, just some of the team stats for Golden State. They're 70 point first half, shooting 69%. <laughs> they've twice this year they've shot 60% in a game. Uh, and when they shoot at least 50, when they shoot at least 50%, they are 32 and 4. 18 assists in the first half on their 25 made field goals. And of course, they lead the league in assists with about 30 a game. Um, you're both going to talk Golden State. You want to talk about Golden State's floor general. Yes. You know, of course, they have a lot of superstars, but Draymond Green is the floor general, as you see if we roll the tape right here. You know, Kenny have had a lot of guys in position. He has the ability to shoot this three. But what do you do as a floor general? You get it to a guy who has a better percentage than a knockdown shooter. <laughs> right here, you know what? The ball comes again. Let me call a play and get it to another guy who's a better scorer than me. And right here, you run this play. You know they're going to concentrate more on Clay. If you just execute, run the play, do what you're supposed to do, you get the ball. Draymond Green, they don't really talk about him a lot because of the big three, big four, but Draymond Green is definitely the floor general for this team. He is uh, number five in the league. Got to keep that ball moving, right, Kenny? Is Draymond Green? Yeah, I was going to run to the board. I'm not even running to the board. Oh come so. on! No, I mean only because of this, Ernie. Because if the Golden State Warriors didn't turn the ball over, they might not lose a game. <laughs> oh yeah. I mean, the, at no point in what Shaq showed, there has ever been a double team. Now, let's say, okay, wow, what does that mean? You have arguably three guys on the floor who are probably in the top seven guys in basketball scoring it and they never get doubled at any point in the game you're never going to double Durant you're never going to double Clay or you're never going to double Steph there's no point where they consistently say every night we're getting double team so since that, that doesn't happen they get to play one-on-one -on -one pretty easily and it's difficult to guard them because and I, and I said this to Kobe one time when he came in his thing about Shaq. I'm like, you're the best one-on-one -on -one player in basketball that never gets doubled because you play with Shaq. And, and you know, and when you know when they're going to win games is because when they get also, when they're engaged, they hit these type of shots. When they, you know, these, these half-court, last-minute, three-quarter court shots, then that means they're engaged. And to me, there's no double team. You're going to let DeAndre Jordan play single coverage on Steph Curry out front, most teams would say, okay, we're going to run at him now. But you can't. You cannot run. You cannot run at him. And it's impossible to guard this team if they don't turn the basketball over and lose interest in the game. Again, here's Klay Thompson. I would be jumping to the pass. So if as a passer passing the ball, I would jump to the ball. And, 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 but I can't jump to the ball because I'm guarding Steph. So when he makes the pass, I would jump to the ball and kind of help him so he can get at But I can't jump because I'm guarding Steph Curry because he throw it right back to him and he gets a three. It's impossible to guard these guys. Well, you can't double any of those guys because you're leaving another all-star open. That's my point. The one thing you got to do, you got to make, <laughs> make Draymond beat you because he's not a good how can you How can you make him beat you when you can't double team anybody you, you, else? You cheat off him. That's it. You cheat. It, it, you, you don't ever cheat off those three guys. But you cause a rotation when you uh, cheat off. Yeah, but yes. you you can force the ball. You can like, you you can cheat. You there's certain guys you play against, like a Kyle Corver. You say, I'm not leaving Kyle Corver. You're not leaving uh, Steph. You're not leaving Clay. You're not leaving uh, KD. So so are you giving us the blueprint then for how you contend with Golden State? Well, I I beat him to death down low. I'm not gonna let uh, little Draymond Green and little skinny Kevin Durant. Uh, just play on one offensive end, like they gonna have to play. So, uh, I'm you, gonna try to get them in. I'm gonna try to get so them. So who, who on? Who, how would you do this if you're the Los Angeles Clippers? Oh, go oh, into DeAndre Jordan. Uh, well, he's not the guy because he can't shoot free throws. And he's not. So who's the guy on Houston then? Because well, that's the team. Actually, the top well, the one guy who's gonna be really huge for is Clint Capella. He's gonna be huge when they play the Warriors. He's got to get every offensive rebound. He's got to get every defense rebound. You can't get those guys extra opportunities. Clint Capella is going to be the difference if they're going to beat the Warriors. You can't outscore them. Uh, I, you, you just can't try to Clint Capella? Yeah, he's going to be. <laughs> uh, 
So if he gets uh, if he gets every offensive and defensive Ernie, rebound, he Ernie, may set some kind of a rebounding Ernie, record. Hey, don't even entertain that, Ernie. <laughs> so what are you saying? Stop it. You don't believe that? Clint Capella's no. a hell of a young player. He is. No, he's no, no, no. Well Clint time. Capella gets drop off. Clint, Clint Capella's not a keen type guy where you can go to him and get a bucket. Don't even try that. Right. No, I'm saying he he's can, a drop he off stop. He's a drop off guy. Jack. I didn't say you can just throw it down low to well, him. Well, he said he was gonna have to. Yeah, he's gonna stop. It down Cut it out, Chuck. That's called offensive rebound. Cut it out. No. Oh, okay. Stop it, Chuck. Hey, you better quit disrespecting the fellas. Yeah, okay. <laughs> We're coming back. <laughs> yeah.